All right, here we go. What you got? I got 24 pounds of gator meat. I got 19 pounds of Boston butt right there. Fattest ones we could find. I'm trying to grease that sausage up a little bit. We're making smoked sausages today. Let's see how this goes, y'all. So what I'm gonna do instead of us having to mix so much, I'm gonna put it in layers. That and it won't it won't be so hard to stir up like that because let me tell you, your hands will get so cold. All right, so do it again. Couple handfuls of the gator, couple handfuls of the pork. Jeff Barron handfuls. Onion, mm, jalapeno right mix. Mm, smells good already. Right. Smells good. Okay. Smells really good. And we're using legs, custom blended seasonings, pork sausage. Okay. Perfect. And we mix that all together. Real good. The fun part. We're fresh out of a mixer. The old fashioned way. Yeah. That's the good way. Enough where you can tie it. <laughs> These don't smell great. No, they really, really don't. <laughs> they don't smell good at all. But they are key for a good sausage. Yeah, this is the real thing. Get these at Walmart. I think this is like mossy oak or something. That center that I'm not doing. Oh, there. There we go. Well, you made it sound like they're not usually like that. Well, they're not but... usually that short. They come out of a little pig, I reckon, instead of a hog. We need a hog with about 100 yards of this stuff. <laughs> that way I can just coil it up on the smoke out there, in the, on the sticks out there. So we have 50 feet of sausages ready to go. Jeff is putting them on his handy dandy back <laughs> here. Stick. Stick. Yeah. <laughs> they don't want them to touch the cattle like they're touching right there. So they spread them up. It's hot. Oh, it's hot. Alright, we have our second batch of 50 pounds of sausages ready to go. Yeah. We're gonna check on our first We're about batch. Stuffed out. Let me tell you, I'm trying to stuff them. Gator sausage. This is gonna hold down. Right, go get them. Go get them. <laughs> you go in there and get them. Nothing to it. It's hot on a firecracker. Oh, goodness. Oh, 
like I hear them sizzling. Don't you hear them sizzling? Mm -hmm. Don't you fall out of there. We don't work too hard. <laughs> All right, so to go with our smoked sausages tonight, we're gonna make some fried gator bites, and this is how we're gonna do it. First, I'm just going to add some buttermilk, add some Franks, maybe about three quarters of a cup. We got can cooker Creole seasoning. Next, we're just gonna add our gator. All right, now we're gonna make buffalo butter sauce. We just have melted butter, we're gonna add Frank's. We're gonna make a beer. Spent the entire day processing or processing as you would say. Over 150 pounds of gator meat, smoked 50 pounds of it. Got some buffalo butter sauce. Our oil's hot. It's getting there. Got her right here, ready to go on the fire. Gonna be perfect. <laughs> How is it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Better be good. We got 50 pounds of it. We got 50 it. pounds of it. It's good though. It is really, really good and it's super juicy because I had to set the vacuum sealer on moist because it was pulling the juice out of it. Every time I'd cut it, it'd just be running out. It's super good. Unbelievable. Hope y'all enjoyed the video, folks. Appreciate y'all.